Hello and welcome back everyone. Finally home again. We are back in Gondor territory and it seems like we missed the attack on the orc sentry camp and also another orc patrol camp has been raised. Now the only thing that's left is that little wall right here then we can go to Barad Dur. And Minas Morgul is left as well. I will now look for the king and maybe I could ask him to attack Minas Morgul. But maybe I should quickly check Minas Morgul before I ask him to do so. Because maybe there are too many enemies. Let me see. Minas Morgul. 724. Together with all these lords we have around 800 defenders. Wow, maybe maybe we should focus on Haradrim camp first, I guess. Mm, I would just look for the king now, or look look for anyone, and see if I could get those guys to attack Minas Morgul. And what is that? Prince Imrahil sends word that he wishes to join his new military campaign. I will of course join him, and I'm curious what he's going to do now. And even though I'm happy because I just returned to Gondor, this could be a sad day. Because I don't really know wh why those two lords are not joining that fight, but it seems like the prince is going to die. Deverin's host is already dead and Prince Imrahil is going to lose that as well. That is very sad. So I can just wait until that battle is over and hopefully I can get revenge very soon. Quest cancelled. Report to Prince Imrahil. Well... But at least I will get my revenge. It seems like there is another battle, but take a look how many units there are. <sighs> we have Mordor, we have Harad, and we have Khand units. Allying together against uh, Gondor. But I don't care, I will now attack those guys. We are under attack. Exactly, you are under attack. I'm going to get revenge from my prince. And it feels good to be here again. And I do have some very nice Lothlorien archers with me. So they will be able to kill quite a few people, I guess. Okay, everyone else. I guess I do have the control over some infantry, it seems. They can, yeah, they can just charge in. The archers will stay here and keep shooting. And I will kill some people myself. I will get revenge for the prince. And the quest cancelled. He was, he was probably about to attack someone. Or attack something, maybe the Harad camp. But I guess now that the quest is cancelled, I will never find out what that was. Okay, at least, as I said, at least I can get some revenge here. Everyone can just charge in. I'm pretty sure we already won anyway. I have no idea how many units I'm fighting currently, but I don't care. I just want you to die, everyone. You will die as well. Not yet, but you will die soon. Mm, Archer of Gondor died. You will die. Come on, they have to die. Yes, like that. Ooh, that could be bad. Run, 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 Marita Tua. Run, run, run. Ooh, that was close. That was close. Ooh, and Glorfindel is right next to me. Yes, we will be able to kill quite a few of you. Boom. Eagle Guard. Who else wants some? You want some. God, please stop missing, Marita Tua. You have to kill them. Yes, they are running away, away I think. Ooh, reinforcements. Come on, come on. Yes. Yes. Very good. Footmen of Gondor killed. Well, as long as my Lothlorien units are not dying, because it would take quite some time to get them back. I, I would have to travel all the way back to Lothlorien and get my units back. Okay, come on. Come on. Revenge for the prince and here I go. A freaking eagle guard killed me. You have been knocked out, but your troops continue to fight. This is what I want to see. Okay. Reinforcements are on their way. Maybe archers, maybe sh uh, maybe you could go back and wait for the reinforcements to come. Okay, spearman, squire of Gondor, Gondor, Gondor. Just wait right here for the reinforcements and then we could do it. Oh, only one dead unit so far. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, I shouldn't have said anything. No, it's two. But we're still fine. And everyone charge in, and the battle should be over in no time. I guess. The battle is over. I think we have to attack them again, because probably some of them ran away. Oh, no, never mind. 
Ooh, a lot of prisoners, which is very, very nice. Because before I started the that fight right here, I accepted a quest to bring some of those prisoners to someone. I forgot the name. Okay, I do have room for four units. Let me quickly take a look through all of those units and let me take... Oh, the uh, Ethelian Rangers, I want them. I still have room for two units. Some archers, I guess. Veteran Archer of Gondor, very nice. Yeah, that's fine. Okay, I think bring eight prisoners, so I'm already able to turn that quest in, but very s it's very sad, but he's going to die as well. Whoever that is, I'm sorry, but I cannot join you. I guess the only thing I can do now is to wait for the prince to regain his strength, and then we will attack someone. Or maybe I should stay close. Let, let me see what's going to happen here. Obviously they died very very quick, but at least I can still get revenge because now the next enemy is going to die Lur I, I couldn't catch the name, but at least he's going to die as well. I'm going to get my revenge here Obviously not a problem. Just just how many enemies were there? only 13 enemies? Obviously not a problem. Okay, could I could I kill someone else so many units? Well, it's sad, but I just have to let them go Maybe I could quickly check if I could take some of those units away. But I do have very strong units. I think I will not give any one of those away. That's fine. If there is another lord in that battle, I'm pretty sure he will take the, the Gondor freed prisoners for himself, I guess. And some scraps. I, but I, 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 wanna, I wanna kill someone else. Yes, 199 units. I think he took all those prisoners I couldn't get. But maybe we could... Come on, follow me. We could, we could take revenge. I know I could tell him to do something specific because I do have enough influence to tell him that. But maybe... I just have to wait for the prince. I have to wait for the prince and then I think I will tell him first to besiege Haradrim camp. And then we could go for Minas Morgul. So while walking around and waiting for the prince, I think maybe, I know you can see it, but, but I ha still have 55,000 resource points for Gondor. Probably because I'm a hero of Gondor and I do get quite a lot of resource points. And I thought I could buy my dear companions some equipment. So Curdil is now looking a lot better and I bought a lot of armor for Faniel as well. And I think I will do the same for Luevana, probably Marl Marblung and Keely Goldfinger. If I could find something something for Keely right here, because I'm not sure if I'm going to find good looking dwarven armor here. But at least I will spend my money for those guys. And we have a lord all by himself. This is probably the first time that I will attack a lord all by myself. But this is what I'm going to do now. And ooh, they will join. They will join the fight. Maybe I should try to separate them. Could I separate you? Traveling to Haradrim camp. Okay, I will let those guys travel away, but I will attack the other ones. Could do you... You're still traveling to Haradrim camp, right? And then they are going to be alone. Yes. Charge them, let's go. This is the first battle I'm going to do on my own. My god, they look tough. Marida Twant, her rebel from Gondor is upon us. Kill them all, take no prisoners. Well, well, well. The first battle I'm going to do on my own. Seems like they're charging right away. That is that is not good. That w won't give my archers any time to shoot. Yep, that is not good. They're charging instantly. Let me try to block some of those or maybe try to lure them somewhere else. Okay, just follow me everyone. Because the more units are f following me, the less units my guys have to fight. Okay, maybe I could kill some myself on my way. Come on, just follow me, everyone. Just follow me. Yeah, some people are stuck here. Very nice. Ooh, but I don't... Oh, please don't get stuck. Oh my god. 105 damage. <laughs> that was probably a throwing weapon. My god. That was... <sighs> okay, we've lost three units, but most of them are already dead. Yes, this is what I want to see. We're able to take on Lord parties by ourselves now. That is very nice. So let me quickly kill the remaining enemies and wait for the king. No, for the prince, not for the king. 
The battle is over, let me see. Could I replace the dead units? Yes, Master Ranger of Ethelion, Veteran Ranger of Ethelion, what else? Still room for one more. Uh, some, maybe I should take at least some infantry because right now, ah, who cares? Let me just take more archers because I don't really have any infantry right now. But I guess my archers will be fine. Okay, who else wants some? I still have some money, so let me walk around a bit more, equip my companions and wait for the prince, because he has to bes besiege something. And we're strong enough to do that. The prince regained his strength, and just take a look. 244 units, 146, 157, 140 and almost 200 units. We are very strong. I will now try to use my influence to tell him to besiege Haradrim camp. Let me see if I could do that. Uh, I think I, yeah, I should upgrade my, my people from time to time. Ooh, mounted archer or royal archer? Give me a royal archer. 112 dinars. I guess maybe I do have to take another gift from Stuart Denethor with me to Lothorian to get some money there because I'm probably going to run out of money. Okay, let me see. We meet again. It feels good to be back, my prince. Do you have any task? I have, like, we're on a campaign. Your advice would have to wait. Okay. Well, he is on a campaign, so he's probably going to do something on his own. Uh, rescue, rescue 16 prisoners. I can do that. I guess I will just accompany him and wait what he's about to do. Maybe he's going to attack Minas Morgul or Harajim camp by himself. And while I'm waiting for the prince to do something, because currently he's just running around, just take, take a look at that army of archers. Just take a look. Just well. I think I formed ranks. Yeah, I think I formed ranks. So I have quite a lot of infantry as you can see, but just take a look at all those archers. <laughs> that is just a little prisoner train right here, so that battle will be over quick, but just take a look. I like it. I like archers. Being a mounted archer has its advantages sometimes. Just take a look. Pew! Pew! <laughs> God, I like it. Killing orcs is fun. Killing orcs is really fun. Seems like the campaign is over, because now I can tell him to do something. I'm listening, Marita Tua. What do you suggest? I wish to lead our men in an assault to an enemy settlement. Indeed, that is no small undertaking, and there are matters which we must discuss before I can give you leave to go. I'm listening. Firstly, we must think of the... Okay, hmm. Yep. I thought it's probably not that simple, so let me see what he has to say. Firstly, we must think of the hindrance of this task. Steel must be kept sharp, soldiers and horses fed, fires kept burning, water fetch. Yeah, wounds tended. I know, I know, I know. Um, what? As we spread you thin already and required, you must prepare to provide what's needed to keep your army operational in a siege. Requires a hundred thousand resource points and 35 influence. Okay, so uh, secondly, you do not have permission, permission to lead our people against an enemy capital. These places can only overcome when the full strength forces stands united. You are to strike only when our foe has been weakened uh, sufficiently. Furthermore, you must know that Gondor is occupied with its own campaign. Our banners will follow you into battle if circumstances permit. No trust, but no understanding to stand alone. Okay, so it seems like it costs a hundred thousand resource points and thirty-five influence, so that he will allow me to lead my own sieges. I guess. So probably, since I don't have the money, it's probably for the best to wait for him to besiege something. Finally, finally, remember that a hero of Gondor, ooh, remember that as a hero of Gondor, of Gondor, you may bask in the glory of a victory, hard won and call that victory. When you join Gondor, Paris by his family, you can carry the fate of Gondor to battle, bring the constant square to the busy, knowing that order, do you still wish to proceed? No, the time is not yet right. Yep, I do not have enough resource points. Okay, so it seems like the only thing I can do is to wait for him to besiege something. I mean, he is quite strong, he has a lot of units, so hopefully he's going to attack something. But it seems like I cannot really attack something on my own. I thought maybe I could suggest him to attack Minas Morgul, but it seems like the only thing I can do is to ask to, you know, besiege stuff myself. But 100,000 resource points. I have 46,000. Well, I guess, let me run around a bit and see what else I could find. 
I just thought of something. I could try the gauntlet again. I am a bit stronger now, but it seems like all of our lords are still accompanying Prince Imrahil. So maybe he is still up to something. Because maybe he's following that guy, but we're very close to Khan camp. Maybe he's going to attack it. Let me follow him and let me see what we could do here. Um, I will, I will um, wait. I, I will just, you know, attack them all the time. That will give my Gondorian uh, friends time to catch up. And then we will attack them. Because I'm not going to attack them on my own. I mean, I am strong, but not so strong. I need more. Only one is not enough. So let me quickly just stop that guy. Now we have two lords. Now three lords on our side. Three lords. I will wait for the last lords as well. Now we have four. And now we still have four. Yeah, four is already enough, but... Uh, one, two, three. Yeah, you know what? I will just charge in. Charge them. Let's go. And here they are. Seems like they are getting close. Maybe I should wait here because we can already kill people even though we're very far away. Because I don't really want to charge in. But it seems like my troops are getting blocked maybe. So maybe I could send him in. Come on, Glorfriend. Do you count as cavalry? I, I just said cavalry charge, but it seems like he does not count. Maybe he, he counts as... I don't really know. Maybe maybe he is in the archer role. Okay, never mind. I thought maybe he's he's uh, you know in the cavalry role. But I guess we. I guess I should just wait here. I do not want to sacrifice all my men. Mm, we should really charge. Let me try to get a better place. Let me try to get a place. Everyone, follow me. Maybe we could try to flank them because I don't want to send my archers in just now. Because we have so many. Gondorian infantrists here, so why would I sacrifice my own men? I guess they could just stay here and uh, you know, continue shooting and I will try to shoot something myself. But, guys remind me that I checked the role of uh, my dear companion after the fight, because I want him to count as cavalry. So that I could tell him all the time to charge in, while all of my other units stay back, because he's quite strong. I really want him to join the battle. Okay, where are our enemies? Right here. One. Yes, I think my, my Lothlorien friends are shooting. I think. Yep, they're shooting very nice. Maybe I should protect them. You know, just in case. Come on, just die. Boom, in your face. But you're still alive, though. Yep, I guess I will just, uh, I will just protect them. Come on. Yes, now that I have a, a bow that, can, that I can actually use on a horseback, that's not such a bad idea. You, you know, everyone could just charge, I guess. Most of them should be dead already. Yeah, 115 are already dead, so there are not that many enemies remaining. Isn't that... Wait, oh, that's a friend! Forgive me, I just shot your horse. You looked like... Okay, never mind. Let's just pretend that never happened. They are quite easily to distinguish, but... Okay, never mind. Okay, let me kill people. Talking about killing people, I think I have a level which I could still spend. Let me see. Yes, I still have a level. Charisma 27. Now I have leadership 10. I like that. Maybe I should keep my weapon points until I get more weapon master. Yeah, that's fine. Now I have leadership 10. I like that. Very, very big army. And that will also decrease the troop wages. Okay, since you do not have a shield and since you guys don't have any... Uh, bows, I could just shoot you from here. Yeah, even without any horse archery, I'm still able to kill you because obviously I just have to shoot in that direction and I will hit an anyone uh, every time. Lothlorien master archer kills. Yeah, maybe I should at least try to tell them to stay back. At least a little bit. Just stay here, everyone. That's fine, I guess. What else do we have? Come on, give me give me some someone to shoot at. Or someone to kill. Like that guy, for example. Boom, in your face. And maybe you as well. Boom. Very good battle. We have lost two units, that's fine. That's fine. The enemy lost much more. Ooh. Ooh. I think that was close. My poor royal warden probably was close to dying. Boom. 288 experience. Maybe I should tell my units to go back. How many units? Oh, only one enemy remaining. Never mind. 
Yeah, kids, I, I still can understand what you're cheering because you're talking in an elfin language, I guess. But we did it. Very, very nice. So hopefully the prince will actually attack the camp now. That would be so awesome. Okay. My food still looks somewhat good. Let me see. What are, what are you going to do? Uh, seems like he doesn't really want to attack Khan camp. Yeah, maybe I could go for the gauntlet. I guess. Seems like he's just standing there. Okay, you know what? I will go for the gauntlet. I do get a message anyway if uh, the prince starts to besiege that thing. Or maybe I could lure... <sighs> Oh my god. That was very, 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 very bad. Uh, could, I, could I change the battlefield, please? I don't like that. That looks a bit better, I guess. Well, in some modifications, you are able to run away from a fight if you killed a few units. So I guess I will just wait for them to come here, kill as many as I can, and then run away. Because obviously I'm not going to do that. I just thought maybe I could lure those guys into the Gondor Lords, but that plan backfired a bit. Okay, could you please kill some people because hopefully, please let, please let me be able to run away. Come on, just, just kill them faster. Come on, archers. We have so many archers now, show your, show your might. You have to kill around 10 or something like that in order to be able to leave. At least it is 10 in other modifications, let me see. We could still kill a few. And now let me try to run away. No, I cannot run away. Okay. Well, I could leave some units behind and try to run away, but I'm not going to do that. Okay. Let's do it, guys. Let's do it. There will be casualties. There will be a lot of casualties, but I don't care. Okay, wow, I have a lot of infantry. <laughs> God. Where is my companion? I forgot to check his role. Okay, never mind. I guess we could just stay here and wait for them to cross the, the mountain. That will be hard. Okay, never mind. Let's do it. Let's do it. Nothing I can do. Let's see. Okay, just just kill as many as you can before they arrive here. Come on, come on guys. Come on guys. You can still do better. Just just shoot. And now let's go. Come on, let let, let me go through. I wanna maybe I could try to lure them away. <laughs> Oh my god. That was probably very stupid. I know I could just retreat and join the fight back in again, but I'm not going to do that. Because that feels a bit like cheating. If you keep retreating, join the, the, the fight, and then let all of the, your archers shoot the people, and then join in again. I'm not going to do that. So we'll just wait here, but take a look. My, my Lothlorien units are strong. Maybe we could actually do that. Let me see what's going to happen. I will just wait now. I thought maybe I could increase the battle size really quickly. No, never mind. I'm already at 350. Because I thought maybe that would make more of my units spawn. But I guess we can just wait and see what happens now. Well, we lost some units. Surgery helped, but we lost 10 units. I guess I can just wait until all of my Lothlorien army is going to die. Then I will have to travel back to Lothlorien, get some new recruits, and then I could come back. But... That surgery helps a lot. I guess I do have to charge again because I think some of them ran away. Uh, no, never mind. Elite skirmish of Rohan. Well, no, I will not get any Rohan units. Pooh. Well, I didn't really mean to attack them on my own, but at least it worked. But it seems like he's not going to do anything. So you know what? Uh, I will go to the gauntlet. No, I won't. Hello there. That lord should help me. Yes, Angbar the Fearless joined. Come on, let's continue to kill the Marida Twa and her rebel from Lothlorien up on us. Because maybe it's not such a bad idea to keep attacking Mordor everywhere I can. Because if their force diminishes or their might, if that might diminishes, maybe then the prince will start attacking Minas Morgul. 
maybe Mordor is still is still too strong. So maybe that's why he isn't attacking Minas Morgul. I don't know. But let me quickly take care of the battle. That's that battle is not going to be very hard, I guess. And we're done. Take a look at all the arrows stuck in the ground. Well, well, well. 36 archers, 3 infantry. Yeah, talking about archers, I wanted to take a look at the role of... Oh God, I forgot his name. Let me quickly check that. Glorfindel, yes. He is counting as an archer. I don't want that. I want him to be cavalry. So now I can select him and just tell him to charge in all the time because he's very good. I really want him to be in the battle. Okay, upgrade everyone. And since the prince is obviously not doing anything, I think... Oh, Fanyul also has a level. Ooh, intelligence, of course, surgery and pathfinding. Very, very nice. Okay, seems like the prince is not going to do anything. Maybe he's just waiting for Angbor the Fearless. Let me see. Are you going to do something? Probably not. Okay, I will go back to Minas Tirith now and try the gauntlet again. Because this time I will win that. Hello, Minas Tirith. How are you doing? Let me quickly sell everything and then it's time to go to the arena. We are back in the arena. We are back. That little fence saved my life before and I'm pretty sure the fence will do the same thing again. Obviously, I'm not going to show all of the earlier waves. I think as soon as I reach around wave 10, 12, 13, something like that, uh, then we will see each other again. But I'm probably going to die for hours again. But I don't care. This is it. I'm going to win the gauntlet. So this is probably the first time that I actually reach wave 13, I think. As soon as that guy is dead, I think, yep, yeah, that is wave 13. <laughs> oh god, just trust me, I'm running around here for ages. Just look at all these dead bodies. I mean, that fence is still saving my life. And every little wave is the same, waiting for all the throwing weapons to be gone, because my god, they are freaking dangerous. Those throwing weapons, I think two of them hit me and just take a look at my HP. Two of them hit me and I'm almost dead. So let, let go of the throwing weapon. And as soon as they are gone, take care of the archers. Hopefully at least. Okay, then be careful for any cavalry who might have made it to the other side. And then just stay here and shoot those people until you're out of arrows. And my arrows are gone in just a second, but that's not a problem because now I can ride these horses. I do have enough riding skill for that. So now I could just mount that horse and look for any dead archer, grab my arrows and go back behind the fence again. This is what I'm doing for, I don't know, one and a half hours. Just trust me, I'm dying here. You don't want to know. Okay, but at least that seems to work perfectly. Because now I can just shoot those remaining guys without being in danger myself. And then it's time for wave 14, the very first time. Maybe wave 15 is the last wave. Because 15 is a good number as well, so maybe 15. But let's see. I don't want to know how... How are you supposed to do that without the fence as your protection? If everyone just storms you, they're just going to kill you. Okay, same thing as before. Let go of the... Th or wait until all the throwing weapons are gone. And now we have two cavalry archers. Oh god, that could potentially be bad. Come on, die. Yes, very good. Now take care of the other one as well. Very good shot, Marie Latoire. Okay, doing fine. 19 arrows remaining and like, I don't know, 15,000 enemies. No, do not shoot Do not shoot their shields. You only shoot their heads. Like that. And like that. And like that. God, guys, I really wanna win that now. I'm, s I'm here for such a long time and I really wanna see what happens if you beat the gauntlet. Okay, nine more arrows. Let me quickly take care of the remaining ones and then we'll go to wave 15. And we are at gauntlet wave 50. Take a look. If that's not the end, then what is the end? <laughs> okay, what do I see? I see one... Okay, someone with throwing weapons. That guy has to die first. Okay, keep moving so that the archers don't hit you. Now he's probably going to charge me, but I do have a horse here as my protection. 
So that could be... Come on, die, 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 die. I said die. Very nice. That guy is dead. Now, the same thing as before. Throwing weapons are gone. Take care of the archers. Very nice. So now, if I run out of arrows, I can just go to that guy and get the arrows. And now just shoot everyone. Let me see how far I could go. I almost made it. I am running around to get some new arrows and I got them. But I do have the feeling that 15 may not be the end. I'm not sure, but <laughs> just take a look how many corpses. Okay, I do have my horse here as a protection. Please let it be the end now. Reached gauntlet wave 16. Are you serious? <sighs> how are you supposed to do that without defense? Okay, same tactic as before. Get rid of the throwing weapons and then get rid of the archers and then get rid of everyone else. And here goes the last guy. Gauntlet wave 17. <sighs> One, two, cavalry archers, a few normal archers, oh my god. Okay, Marie d'Artois, show me that you are a good archer, kill those guys. Very good, number one. Come on, come on, come on, that guy has to die. At least those guys will drop their arrows now. So I do have quite a lot of arrows now, but the arrows, the enemies will probably make it to the other side. So I should be careful. Here comes the first one. Okay, no problem. Let me kill the remaining guys and then it's time to go to wave 18. Guys, if I die now at wave 18, I'm, I'm sitting here for almost two hours. I have to win that now. Reached gauntlet wave 18. I can tell you one thing. The problem with all these dead cavalrists here is that it's very hard to hit those heads from time to time because we have so many horses around here. But we're close to wave uh, 20. Let me quickly kill those three guys and then get some new arrows and then go to wave 20. Here goes the last guy from wave 19. Read. No, oh, wait, this was 18. Okay, never mind. Ha! <laughs> Only 19. Not a problem, right? Let's see. God. So, anyone wants a horse? I have so many horses here. Maybe you want to buy some? I have enough. Those Gondor hunters. I could open a, uh, I can open a store. Okay, this is the end of wave 19. You don't want to know how long it took to get that far. Okay, wave 19. My quiver is full. One more hit and I'm dead. Let's do it. That guy has to go. Wave 20. That has to be the end. It has to be. Okay, let me take a look what we have. I'm going to die, right? I see I see three cavalry archers. No, four cavalry archers. Okay, I see a few guys with throwing weapons. Oh my god! One more little hit and I'm going to die. This is where I die. Oh god, please no. Please no. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god, oh god. Okay, 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 okay. We can do this. We can do this, right? We can do this. So many cavalry archers. Please just die. Okay, number one. Oh god, this is too close. I have to, I have to get behind a mount. At least some protection. Okay, come on, come on. The other one as well. Please die, please die, please die. Very good. Okay. Priority number one, cavalry, uh, yeah, cavalry, because they could make it behind the fence, and that is dangerous. C can you hear even the music stopped? Because I'm, I'm, I'm in here for like two hours, the game probably thinks, yeah, that guy probably already fell asleep. Okay, never mind, here's the music again. Okay, take care of the cavalrist first, come on. Oh god, my heart, my poor heart, I can't take it anymore. Come on, go away, I have to deal with... I have to take care of that guy. Please go away, the shield. God, my heart. My poor heart. Okay, what do we have? We have seven arrows and probably 30,000 remaining enemies. If there is a wave 21, I, I, I cannot do it anymore. Not today. I'm probably going to die instantly if there is a wave 21. Okay, my arrows are gone, but there are some cavalry archers right next to me. 
So let me quickly get oh my god someone has throwing no don't tell me that guy is going to kill me now No get close. Yeah, I, I think he used all his his arrows now uh, not his arrows, but his throwing weapons If there is going to be a wave 21 Don't tell me there is a wave 21 Come on just die Twa No. No. Just no. Okay, seems like no one with throwing weapons and no one with a bow. Maybe I could do it. Give me some time. Of course, I died. Of course. Wave 20 freaking 1. A thousand experience and 600 resource points. You have survived up to Gauntlet 21. Was What an amazing feat of arms. I can't take it anymore. I seriously can't take it anymore. I'm sitting at just the Gauntlet for almost two hours now. I died so many times. I'm, I'm actually curious. Did I not get a level? I'm so close to another level. Okay, as I said, I cannot take it anymore. Second attempt at Gauntlet. I'm quite happy to be honest. I mean wave 21, I'm getting somewhere. Maybe I need some more iron flash, maybe some more weapon proficiencies, but weapon proficiencies are not going to do anything for me. I guess I just need more iron flash. Or, you know, maybe I just ran out of luck. Okay, for the time being that shall be enough. As I said, I can't take it anymore. Next episode, hopefully the prince decides to besiege something, because I'm back in Gondor and I'm ready for action. I'm ready for action. Next episode, let's see what that will bring. Until then, farewell.